Well, we pushed our luck at the last one. You think we negotiated do half price? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. What do you think? You think they tear me up on the video if I negotiated at the Salvation Army? You should try it. Please be worth nothing. Please be worth nothing. Please be worth nothing. And no, I can't lower it. <laughs> <laughs> My wife would uh, divorce me if I could put that in the car on the way home from Myrtle Beach. All right, now I'm gonna I'm gonna buy this, but I'm gonna step out way out here on a limb and ask you a question. Uh huh. Hey, y'all! Back in South Carolina, where are we at? We were in uh, Myrtle's Inlet. Look at this. I didn't even introduce this guy. I don't even need to introduce this guy. Last year when I was here, I needed to introduce this guy. Now he's international superstar, the bearded thrift machine. How's everybody Check it doing? out, y'all. He's going to take me to some good wheels. Last year we did okay. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully we'll do better. And maybe time. maybe we'll do a little bit. Yep. Uh, maybe maybe better, maybe worse. I'm yeah. not doing any shoes, though. Yeah, I'm not yeah, taking yeah. shoes home. I got so many. Yeah, I'm hopefully another big lion because that sold pretty fast. So. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Let's go. <laughs> Getting a cart, you want to share a cart, or you want to because you know we're gonna find something. Gotcha. I say that gotcha. when you get a cart, though, you don't find anything. Yeah, that's, that's why I never start off. That's why <laughs> look at this guy. There you go, you could be the oh, village people, the man. Of your... Captain and Tennille. Oh, what do they charge for hats down here? These dollars, tailor made. Yeah, so you're a dollar still down here. Yeah, that'll work. Look, look at that thing. On that I like that right there. Let's see cobra caps maybe it could be part of cobra kai well on see the, uh, see the tag cobra caps but i don't think it is <laughs> hey, <it's close> enough, <laughs> how you doing hi hi i'm Brittany. <laughs> how you doing what's your britney yeah and your husband's gonna freak out yes why is your freak husband because he watches your youtube channel well, he watches your youtube channel oh he look at this guy YouTube channel every day <laughs> all right well you, you gotta you know what you gotta do then? I gotta get a you gotta get a sticker yeah. back pocket it's for the people listening they that's not gross it's the back pocket of my backpack just saying it's the very back pocket the oh, very one. back pocket you got it i just called him he's like are you kidding me <laughs> <laughs> it's funny you got it yeah all right you, you guys are it. awesome very nice thank you all right i found a sweet shirt and then he cut in front of me and found a better shirt but i'm still buying this one because i like the graphics on it 2008 and there's check out the back end on this guy look at how big that is i'm buying that one but he finds a harley shirt over here yeah, we just got a nice little Harley Dave. It's not old, it's not vintage or anything, but it's not bad. It's got a really good graphic oh, on the back. Like it. And oh, you know yeah. it's from Aruba, so you know it's a good one. <laughs> that is really cool, actually. That is really cool. I so love, I love t-shirts, so I gotta force myself to walk away. Yeah. There you go. Well, sunny, sunny weather. That's not bad. Dollar ninety nine. I might get that for me. Yeah. Uh, if you don't want it. The, uh, ah, no back. battery back. Oh hold on. There you go. Hold on, you might be in luck. There you go. Well you can buy it. I don't want to jump in on you there. And tin is not broke. No, and it's not even bent, so that's nice. I've got comps at uh, 30 free ship and $15.99 plus ship, so there's $10 in it. That's not bad. And it's got the back plate. You, you want to grab it? Yeah. I'll it. So I'm not, pa so these actually are going okay. They're going for like 25 bucks, but this one doesn't have the remote. 25 bucks wow. plus shipping, so no remote, plus it's got a crack in it, so no good. But I'm telling you, look, Sony Blu rays, if you get the right ones, these are the tiny ones. I've been doing pretty good lately for me. I'm buying that if you let me. You let me? Y'all like right. to buy it. That's going underneath my tree with the chickens. It's a big uh, Blu-ray. Phillips. Phillips. Night. BD Live. I might check it out. Look at that. It's Tupperware, man. Tupperware. Oh yeah, look at that thing. I don't know. I'm gonna look sometimes with the lids. $1.99. That hurts my soul to pay that much for Tupperware. Yeah, it's my style back here. I'm not taking them out of here, but cassette racks. Those are kind of cool cassette racks. Plastiplex. They're cassette racks. Oh, yeah. Plastiplex. 99 cents a piece. They're not worth much, but they're kind of cool. Now, is that worth cleaning? So, two go for $16, but there's four. So, I was thinking maybe put them all together and sell them for like 30 plus shipping. Oh, yeah. But you see how they're. I mean, they're not exactly clean. They're gonna take a magic eraser to them. But there are four, so four bucks into 30 might be worth it. I don't know, I'm gonna leave them here and then decide a little bit later. Plastiplex. But that wood grain, fake wood grain yeah. stuff, people like it. Why, I have no idea, but they like it. Let's 
against this guy. Collectible plates, you know. You always oh, yeah, gotta buy those. Always pass on those. It's a carry American arbitrage video right there. I should take my camera here. I'm gonna do it right here. I'm gonna make a make a TikTok right here. I'm gonna do a carry arbitrage here. Let me go. He starts over here and he zooms in here and then he tells people, hey, don't buy collectible plates, they're never worth it. Right? And then he makes a million dollars on TikTok. There you go. And he doesn't even have to buy anything. Right. There you go. It's funny because that's I never seen that's from a Rapello. Yeah. That's the uh now I just teased all that and it's probably worth something, right? <laughs> That's from a... Uh, I gotta look it up. Yeah. I I'm sure it's imagine. not. It's from... Dude, what kind of fisherman is gonna be? What? They could... Is that a walleye? That's what it says. Midnight walleye. Oh, look, he's got a rappella in his mouth. That's funny. That'd be so funny for 50 bucks. <laughs> yeah, I highly doubt it. <laughs> no, I mean, I you're, 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 you fish and you're not. I'm you not don't want that, that thing, right? No. Midnight, let's see. I'm gonna have to eat my Let's word. Please be worth nothing. Please be worth nothing. Please be worth nothing. Look at this, dude. Pre-owned. Twenty-five. Oh, that's best offer. Free ship. Seven plus. Seven bucks. All right, good. That's All, my whole concept of reselling would have been shook to the core if a collectible <laughs> plate was worth something. <laughs> that's funny, man. I like. It. Here, look at this. Tommy Bahama. Oh, there you go. Bottle opener. Bro, that's well, that great. might be worth that something. Great. No Jim Shore here today, just fake Jim Shore. Look at that, great bargain. Who needs Jim Shore when you got great bargain? Look at this guy. I wonder how much they want on these guys. I feel like we found some Playmobil last we time did. we yeah, were the here. Hockey, they actually sold the pieces. Did they? Pieces, one they wanted out, parted out kind of stuff. Playmobil Magic, $6.99, let me check it out. Complete, I think it's 40 bucks at least. Is it taped on this side? There's a lot of parts in there. I'm wondering if everything is here or not. Don't know. Is that that? Well, no, maybe it is everything. Because it's got that. It's got the top. Is it a dolphin? It uh, does it have a dolphin. It's a good question. I don't see a dolphin. I'm not seeing a dolphin. Oh. There it is right there. Yep. There's a dolphin right here. But there that's a that's a pink dolphin. There's no blue dolphin. All right. Yeah, something. Cause there's not even a pink dolphin on this one. There might be. There's a pink dolphin right there. Oh yeah, there it is. Yeah. But I don't see the blue dolphin. We're missing these guys. Yep. They got that big giant thing, which I don't even understand. So I'm gonna have to pass on that guy. I hate to say. That would have been a winner. These sell brand new for like 80 bucks on eBay. Really? That's right. You haven't paid yet, have you? No, I haven't. All right, make him pay for this one for me, too. How much do these cost, anyway? They are $199. $199, man. Yep, but they are. And no, I can't lower it. <laughs> lower it to $99? I'm going to buy it anyway. It's, it's, it's Animal Kingdom with the tag. What the heck? There's is that going thing. on your bill? Yes, it'll go on my bill. Uh, his bill is open here. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, no, no, no. Would you like to run it on sure. the 24? Fine, Thank you. <laughs> He's a nice guy. He rounds up. <laughs> <laughs> Salvation Army. It's been a long time since I've been. They have one of these up at North Myrtle. Or they used to, anyway. There you go. That is Wedgwood. Mm hmm. Matter of fact, I have one very similar to it. They're worth about ten dollars for each. Year. Dude, my wife is gonna be so jealous. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Good. I just going had a lady good. say that my husband's gonna be so jealous. Yeah, really. Uh, so good. What's Jason. your name? Jason. 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 Yeah. All right, you gonna get a sticker? Yeah. Okay. Good. Uh, All right, we'll get a picture. Yeah. Let's get it. Picture. Now, what's she gonna be jealous of? Him or me? You? She's mad at him. Oh. Yeah, well. she, I'm, I'm old news. When you came down last time uh -huh. and uh, we saw the thumbnail and it was in front of the Goodwill where mm -hmm. we live and she, I thought she's going to lose it. <laughs> That's funny. What'd you yeah. find, man? Come on, what is that? I like flipping media. And they're sealed, so $1.99? Yeah. yeah. That's a pretty good price for a seal. That's not yeah. too bad. All right, I'm going to look at these board games here because I'm weird like that. Life. You can sell the little car pieces in there, little tiny pigs in the cars if you're insane like me. You can do that. 
I'm not seeing anything here. I see. Remember last time I was here? Yeah. Me looking at one of those. See how this one? See, I was trying to look it up. What yeah, are they? What are they cracking? Yeah. What are they called again? So they're umbrella stands. Okay. But a lot of times, golf like pro shops will use them and they'll put used golf balls in them right. and sell them right out of there. Because that would sell really good. I the only know. problem is that condition just yeah. a little bit. For ten ninety nine, that'd probably sell for. I'm guessing here if that one's on there at all because of the night i mean that's nice embroidery that's probably at least 70 dollars is my guess but the condition Listen, might make it like 40. no that's what i was thinking but i'd check it out i'd look it up and see if you find i could it. remember that the it's an umbrella stand umbrella stand. usually what it is sometimes they use them as trash cans people put them in man caves you know yeah with the golfers and stuff and that's but what that's what it is what i was looking at was the condition of it and i was like oh man but man i mean it looks nice when you're it does. you know putting it on the ground at a man cave but it's not bad i've seen worse that has the this mm -hmm. but a lot of them you're right on the money 60 bucks and look at the condition of that one yeah that's nice so there's 40 so mm -hmm. the condition is poor on that one down mm -hmm. there yeah this one's poor yeah, it is poor. And it got $59. Free ship or plus nope, ship? No, plus ship. I think it's a no-brainer. I think you should get it, especially with all the people that follow you for golf clubs, yeah. you know? One went, if you could get the, the mini vapor bag, two, I mean, two fifty on the best, on best offer. offer. But still, you know, it's good. 125 for this. So some of them are good. I think it's yeah, worth it, too. I think it's worth it. Because it looks good. This is the only, it's got a little bit of issues. Mm -hmm. But it look from, you know, from three feet away, it looks great. It looks awesome. I'm taking it. Awesome. <clears throat> you didn't reckon it was it my voice that gave me away <laughs> you want a sticker you got a sticker yeah right here in the back pocket right stickers. here you gotta get stickers how do you not have stickers Hi. you see it yep i got one okay that's good you find anything good today is this your stack no this is just a couple books a here couple. so far Are you, uh, i saw you guys Amazon at the seller, other ebay seller Both. okay both. All right, well, good luck to you. You too. Right, so, That's you know, right. I'm a history teacher, so when you see that name, Will Durant, it's a famous history name. History writer, check out this set down here. Unfortunately, I'm looking, so they want, what do they want, $44 for this? This is, I used to read a lot of this because I was obviously a history teacher. But it's an 11 book set. It's missing number 10. That's... 143 if the, if all of them were there because these look like they're in pretty good shape it's probably 150 dollars for that set but it's missing a book and they're in okay shape i would buy that for like 25 bucks with with that missing book but man i'm tempted i wonder i wonder if they negotiate here i doubt it but man this is a great name and that's a great set huh and it's on the bottom shelf, but $43.99 plus tax. I mean, you're going to end up getting... Mm, I don't think I could sell it. I don't think I could get more than about 80 for it because without that book. And that's not worth it to me. But I wonder if they will. I might go ask the lady. That might be worth something, too. I'll have to check it out. Hey, that's the devotion. I'm going to look that one up and see what that one's worth. I don't know. What do you think? You think they'd tear me up on the video if I negotiated at the Salvation Army? You should try it. You've seen them do it, but it's always worth it. <laughs> that's funny. All right, so let me ask you a question. Would you say that's brand new? It it looks like it's never been used. Well, it has a little bookmark in it, though, doesn't it? Yeah, I can't sell that as brand new, mm -hmm. but let me tell you, that thing is it's like... very close to it. Yeah. may have been opened. $2.99. What did you find here? Uh, this is from the same person, yep. and I just looked it up. That one is brand new. Yep. And they sell twenty four ninety five free shipping. There you go. Goes, and you see this right there's here? There's another one. Yep. There you go. Two winners. That's not too bad. I bet you. I'm curious here. See how they're... Well, it's not the same size, right. so they may not be the same. Perhaps today... I would, if I was, if I were you, I would get a Matter of fact, why don't you get them all, put them all in a lot and sell them all together? Work. What do you think? I think it's a good idea. Okay, then I won't Perfect. have to take it home. Yep. <laughs> Save weight when you drive. <laughs> Look at this, baffling baseball trivia. Turner might like that. What is this one? Baseball brain teasers. I might have to get this for Turner. 
All right, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna oh. ask these people. Uh, Commonwealth. <laughs> yeah, I seen you, man. Yeah, I seen you on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, nice how you been? You. I'm good, dude. How you been? Good, good. Just he's getting a little YouTube going. Yep, yep. Definitely. Excuse me. Oh, he, he's in town. He comes in town once a year. Once a year. Oh, once a year. Yeah. Nice. Where you from originally? Um, originally I'm from California, but I'm from Virginia. Okay, gotcha. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet mm -hmm. you. All right, now I'm gonna I'm gonna buy this, but I'm gonna step out way out here on a limb and ask you a question. Uh huh. So there's a set of books back there for forty three ninety nine. That's missing one book out of the out of the volume set. So I'm wondering. I'm wondering if you'll do it. And if you won't, that's fine. You're not hurting my feelings, but. Mm -hmm. It's missing one book, but I'll show it to you. And I, I, I'm close as it is, but it, not quite there. This is forty-three ninety-nine. It's missing number ten. Would you do anything better than that? And I'll definitely take it out of here. See, uh, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then eleven. Hmm. And I, if you don't, that's fine. I understand. How much it's, is on it? It's forty-three ninety-nine. Take maybe $7 off of it. Seven? Mm -hmm. Well, since you do that, I'll definitely tell you. Okay. Right. okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to grab it. You can let the gentleman in front of me go, and I'll bring these up. Look at this. David Jeremiah. Oh, yeah. Take it. <laughs> with the collection. I might just buy, buy volume 11 and add it to it, you know? Thank you so much. You're welcome. We're just gonna set this, set that on the ground. That's yeah. fine. I'll we'll just pay it. You want a box? That would be awesome. Excuse me. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Very, very nice of you. Thank, Thank you too. again. You I appreciate so it. All right. I remember coming to this one. I remember there being electronics on that wall. I thought yeah, they last time. It all around the hatch right here now. All right. Here, shirts, pants. I gotta look here. T-shirts, two forty-nine. Okay. Beer so that's a good one. So it's four ninety nine. The tall ones are worth it for sure. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Definitely right? worth it. For beer wear, boom, that ain't bad. Yeah. With so the that is a. Let me look at a quart. Uh, let's see, eight quart. I think that's what it says, right? Eight quart. So eight quart's a good one for four ninety nine. I would definitely buy Can't that. that. Plus, a lot of times these ones get these get old, and you got to put like a butcher block oil on it to make mm -hmm. it kind of shine. And so you don't have to do anything with these right here. All you got to do is clean that, and you're good to go. Not a little Windex bad. on the side. Boom. Definite, definite winner. All right, you see what I'm talking about? See this handle compared to that handle? Oh, yeah, yep. I mean, there's no handle on it, but you get the point, right? right? And so sometimes that happens to the tops, too. And that's $2.99, yeah. so I would never buy that, but that's a winner. Man, we don't see any electronics where I'm from. There's another one right there, you see it? It's probably still not a winner. $1.99. Cheaper. Cheaper, but still. No lid. No. I don't know. You could make a buck or two, but I wouldn't. Oh, pure ice water filter. $3.99, there's a little money in that. Look at this. This might, this might be new. This thing's new. This thing's never been used. If it's new, I'll buy it. I wasn't going to buy it. I was going to talk about it like it's something you can part out because sure. you can. But that's all new in the package in there. That might be $25 because it's new plus yeah. shipping. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. We'll see. I shouldn't say that without looking, but I think that's about what they are. I usually look for the super shooters and pass on the salad shooters. Right. But now the market's changed on the super shooters and the salad shooters are okay now. Huh. Talking about super shooters for so long, the market went bad, you know. <laughs> Fiber optic poinsettia. That looks interesting to me. I remember growing up in California, they had the ice capades and they had all those little fiber optic things. Yeah. And so I was always intrigued with it. Yeah. I don't know. It's, it's been used. It's all in there though. So I want to buy a fiber optic poinsettia. I don't think I do. But I bet you that sells. How much do they want? $2.99. Man, I bet that sells for $20. I'm not taking it home. My wife would probably be mad at me. 
Or I bet that sells. I saw you grab something here. I'm gonna sneak in and grab that right there. Mm -hmm. It's dandy. Sneak in and grab Chewy too. Go ahead. How much do they charge here for flush? $1.99? Probably, yeah. Disney Parks Chewy. Right by you, sir. Uh huh. Disney. Funny, last time I bought one of these, I was in South Carolina as well. I was in Columbia. They're dandy and they're dancing like chickens. Huh. I'm gonna see if they're still worth money. They used to be. There's another dandy. Dandy's not amazing, y'all, but it, it sells like that, that. That's a little pink bunny and it's in great shape. So it's not old. Dandy has old stuff, but this is not old. Don't get fooled by the tag. Collector's choice. Now, this might not sell till next spring, but it'll sell for a minimum of 10 plus shipping minimum maybe 15 so i've sold them before and check that out bigsby never seen that before huh. all right so he sent he found a vintage baton what do you yep. got to my surprise vintage star see these are called um a certain uh, has like a grip right there. Uh -huh. and this would be about a 20, well, that's probably more than 22 and a half inches. Mm. That one went on bid for $22.45 oh. plus shipping. So you're going to be able to get 30, 40 bucks for yep, that? Yeah, probably. Nice. Who would have thought? I only like for, it. Only for $1.99. There you go. Can't beat it. I like it. That's a good eye right there to see. You could tell immediately that it was vintage by the coloration right. of, of yep. that right there. That's cool. Not bad. I like it. Man, the old school. Look at that. Yeah. Look at the stickers right there, you know? Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Panasonic. Hey, Have you looked it up? I did. Uh, it's like $25 plus shipping. There you go. And they're asking $3 people, for it. Look, see, because that looks old, right? You get those colors. Mm -hmm. For whatever reason, people like it. But a lot of homeschoolers, too. So it might be a cross thing, right? The, yeah. the whole. Plus, if you ever buy the new ones, I know this because I'm a teacher. The new ones are terrible. Really? And the old ones actually work. There you go. <laughs> so I'll get that might it for be, three bucks. Heck yeah. I just clean it up a little bit, good to go. There you go. I like it. I do think I'm gonna grab these. Oh yeah? But I've sold some before, like they're like tiki, like goofy and different stuff and staplers, and they sold for crazy good money. Hmm. And I think that uh, I'll find a comp somewhere, maybe not on eBay, but that's a notepad holder. That's uh, for paper clips. That makes sense. It's got the magnet right uh, there. Yeah, 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 and then this will be for pencils. And they nice. look like they're in pretty good shape for the price. So Disney China. So I don't know. I think it's probably actually close to vintage. I bet. I don't know exactly where, but maybe early 2000s. But I'm gonna grab it for $1.99 each. For some reason, my audio went out on this Rudolph pickup. I avoid a lot of Rudolphs, but this one was animated. The nose lit up, and it sung. Good pickup. Should sell really well. We did have some Snoopy, y'all, uh, but it's got some. They're kind of messed up. So I'm. Pa hey, look at that. Fozzie Bear. This is, uh, should be 86, 87, 87. And this is a McDonald's, from that McDonald's set they came out, Christmas Carol. But it's missing its hat. I, I hate leaving these behind, but they're really not worth anything. If it has a hat, it's worth a little bit of something. Uh, they got Hungry Hippos. I like to sell those marbles if I can get them for like 50 cents at a yard sale, but it's $2.99. I don't think that's an old version at all. Doesn't look like it anyways. And I'm not even hear the pieces in there, so. But this is what intrigues me more than anything. You can part this thing out. It's $1.99, I get that for that right there. These movies are for crazy money. People love this game. I think it's 25 to 30 though, um, used. So we'll have to see if if the pieces aren't all there then i will part out some good ones and still make some money but if they're all there i should be able to make some money on that all right julian says this is the most expensive thing he's ever seen at a goodwill 300 bucks so you tell me in the comments tell me what the most expensive thing so this is each time there's yeah. each there's four of them they want they want that much they want 300 each yep. Did you look it up or they work? Well, they're, they're worth 1200 bucks, what they're asking, because they're Muslim Shelby's, okay. but they're takeoff, so they're used. Uh, but I mean, they're, they're never used. I mean, yeah. But, yeah. Uh, the most expensive thing I've ever seen. Well, we pushed our luck at the last one. You think we negotiate, do half price? <laughs> yeah, negotiate. For, uh, for My wife would uh, divorce me if I could put that in the car on the way home from Myrtle Beach. There you go. How many? 
Um, I have uh, whatever's there. I have five. These are a dollar ninety-nine a piece. That's it. That is it. Twenty-one ninety. No, I'm not military or veteran. And I normally don't round up, but he rounds up, so I'm gonna feel bad if I don't. <laughs> normally, people don't even ask me. They look at me and they're like, "This guy's not rounding up. up. He's not rounding up." <laughs> You don't have a bag back there, do you? No. No? Mm -hmm. Well, then I'm going to take back my roundup. I don't do that. <laughs> I'm just teasing you. I'm teasing you. Am I signing? I'm teasing. It's just fine. Don't worry. Just signed it on the uh -huh. bottom. Yeah, okay. roundup can't get a bag here. Jeez. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate it.